Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to yet another video. Today, I'll be going through Raw Excel, how to set it up, how to get started with using it. If you're new to using Raw Excel, it's basically just a customizable math acceleration software, or math acceleration software, or math acceleration software. Uh, it has a graph which is very useful in seeing when the acceleration kicks in and how much is experienced. Um, before jumping into anything, I do want to tell you that um, it is completely safe to use Raw Excel and it's not bannable whatsoever in Valorant. GamerDoc on Twitter, um, who is the anti cheat specialist, also stated that anti cheat does not ban you for using Raw Excel. It's completely safe and there's no need to worry. Now that we've cleared the wind, let's get to it. Woo! Yeah, baby! That's what I've been waiting for. So before doing anything with Raw Excel itself, we have to change a few settings for Valorant on our homepage um, just to make the experience a lot smoother. So we want to right click Valorant, we need to go to properties, to compatibility, change high DPI settings and make sure that you have override high DPI scaling behavior, um, make sure you have that checked. Next we need to go to mouse settings in Windows itself, then we need to go to additional mouse settings. Then we need to go to pointer options and we need to make sure that enhanced pointer precision is off um, because this is basically just like this is basically windows version of raw excel and it can cause some input delays if you do use raw excel with this ticked um, so just just turn this off to make sure this is smoother when you're using uh, raw excel now on to the big juicy meat of the video um, in order to get Raw Excel, um, there'll be a GitHub link in the description. Okay, so once you click on the GitHub link in the description, this will come up. Then you want to come down to releases here, um, where it says latest, you click this. Um, you want to scroll down and you want to just download this Raw Excel zip file right here. Some people did need WinRAR to install this and open it and stuff. However, I didn't, so I don't know if the video I watched was a bit outdated for the version that I got. Um, but yeah, I didn't need it. So what you need to do next is go to installer um, Just click this and install it and then once you have um, It will ask you to restart your computer. So I'll see you guys once we've restarted a few moments later Okay, now we've restarted and we have everything installed and um, We've gone into properties on Valorant and sorted everything there now You just want to go ahead and open raw Excel. This will be in the same file from before um, but before we do anything with the actual chart itself, um, we've got to go over to charts at the top, then scale by mouse settings, then DPI, and just set this to whatever DPI you use. I use 900, I customize it in my mouse software, but just enter whatever, whatever DPI you use here. Then you need to head down to poll rate, which is just below that, and set this to 1000. This just helps reduce input delay um, caused by raw XL. Now, people do all kinds of crazy mathematicals, which I'm too brainwashed to do. Um, so I just played around with mine to get my ideal chart. However, I will show you guys how to do it just in case. Um, so in order to do so, um, there will be a link in the description to get the raw Excel helper, uh, which is basically, I think it's on, just on Google Drive and it just, it helps you calculate um, what your ideal chart would be. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and open that up. So this is what the chart should look like and um, we do have to create a copy I think so we can edit on it so we're just gonna go ahead and do that now make a copy bing bong bow okay so once you have this opened up and you've ha you've made your copy okay so what we have to go ahead and do is enter your DPI which mine is 900 and to your desired DPI feel mine is I'm gonna go 1600 and your in-game sense, mine is 0.35. I am a low sense player, so this will probably help you if you are too a low sense player. Now, this is where the super crazy kabonkulonky mathematicals come in. So you do need a calculator for this, although it is simple maths. Wait, but I just said it was super complicated. <laughs> anyway, um, so once you have your calculator up, to find the low sense, we have to take our high sense and divide it by 2. So I'm going to take my high sense, which is 0.35, times that by 2, which is 0.7. Then we have to input that in to here, 
Then to find the highest sense, we have to take 0 0.35, 0 0.35, and then times this by three, um, and then input that into here. Oh wait, what was it? 1.05, yeah, 1.05, cool. Now, if you are using two EDPIs, just set the low EDPI to 280. This is just the average lo uh, low EDPI of all pros. Um, and then to get the high EDPI, we're going to do 280 times by 2, which gives us 560. So we just enter that into our high EDPI. There we go. And now we have two new curves to try out in Raw Excel. Again, I just played around with mine. However, this may be like a good foundation for you guys um, just to kind of get started with it. Um, Cause it will just give you kind of like the basic chart for your, uh, what you inputted for your like desired feel and things. Um, so once you do have that, I do advise just, you know, messing around with it and getting the, a, a good feel for, for exactly what, what you want. Okay, so for you cringy, high sense maniacs bro what are you talking about man i can provide you with um tenses chart if you like so tenses is you want to make sure that this is set to classic um you need to make the sense multiplier one um the cap type is output the cap output is 1.75 the input offset is 15 and the power is 2.5 which I already have. Um, however, if you do play on a low sense, then mine might be more comfortable for you guys. Um, so I'll go ahead and show you mine now. So mine is also classic here. My sense multiplier is 0 0.5. My acceleration is 0 0.03. My cap type is output. My cap output is 1.75. My input offset is 0 and my power is 2.5 go ahead and apply and this is what it looks like mine is just a slower kind of more controlled sense and then when i flick it does speed up so even when i'm playing on a, on a lower sensitivity i can still flick quite well rather than it just being you know flicking across the screen like that so with all that covered that is all you need to know on how to set up raw excel and calculate your ideal chart if this video did help, be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment if you need any help or if you have any issues. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.